Okay, so we are going to take a look at the Winter Premier Pet Box. And we are going to open 10 of these boxes. I wasn't originally planning on playing this pet gotcha, but I actually changed my mind and I've decided I'm going to open up 10 boxes. So we'll take a look at items and rates last, but these are the four new pets. We have two new types of uh, whales here. And we have the new Blazing Cat Sid Whistle and the Dazzling Cat Sid Whistle. And here's the uh, Celestial Whale Whistle. So from left to right. So that must be the one with the stars. And then the Glacial Whale Whistle, which is the one on the right here. So for the uh, Dazzling or Blazing Cat Sid, when you summon it for the first time, you can select one combat talent that will uh, have a training EXP 2 point two times buff um, applied to it whenever your pet is summoned. And once you pick a combat talent, you can't change it, so pick carefully. So this is just like the other two cat pets. Um, only you pick a combat talent instead of a life talent. And here's all the stats on it. And then let's get to the bonus system. So... Buy and open up a certain amount of Winter Premier Pet Boxes to get bonus rewards. So, bonus points are only given during the duration of the event sale. The Winter Premier Pet Box must be opened during the sale period to receive the bonus points and the bonus rewards. So, each Winter Premier Pet Box gives you one point. Items received from the Winter Premier Box will be stored in the point inventory. And then, uh, let's see. So at three points, we get a golden supplement. A glimmering golden supplement. I think that takes your pet to, like, level 200. And then at five points, we get a pet exclusive pouch. That just can be used to, like, expand your pet's inventory. And at eight points, we get a pet adoption medal. So it's kind of nice to get one of those for free. And this is the part I like the most. So at 10 points, you can get a Winter Premier Pet Selection Box. So you can use this to select in one of the four uh, new pets from this box. So this means there is a 100% guarantee that you can get one of the new pets uh, that you want from this event. And that's actually really good. So you can pick one of these four with that selection box. And of course, uh, during this time, the pet adoption medals are 50% off. So you can use those to sell your pets. And now let's take a look at the uh, items and rates. Oh, and of course these boxes are, it's 4,900 NX for one of them, and three of them cost 14,700 NX. And then the uh, 10 boxes is 40, 5k NX. So basically, you know, $45 for 10 rolls. And now let's have a look at the items and rates. So these are all the pets that are in the gotcha. And uh, all the new pets do have the lowest, you have the lowest chance of getting all the new ones, but like. Overall, their rates aren't horrible, and there's not too many junk pets in here either. And you're guaranteed to get one of these new four pets anyway, so that's not too bad. Okay, let's uh, get into game. So Xanified Cat will be doing this pet box opening, and we're going to be doing it in Ternana. Okay, so here are the pet boxes. Put them right up here so they're nice and visible. Okay, the haughty Arctic Fox Quinn whistle. So, so that's from a old uh, pet box um, in the past. I think that may have been the last one we had too. And then the Nyan Punch Jack whistle. That's an old one. Okay, so Astral Pegasus whistle. And we get the Glimmering Supplement because we opened up like three of the uh, boxes. And this will take your pet to level 200. 
So we have the mm, Abyss Cat Sid Whistle. I don't think the Abyss one is a new one, is it? Let's let's find out. No, the Blazing and Dazzling ones are new. So this is one of the older ones um, that can that can that you can like select a life talent with when you summon it. So it's still pretty good that we got one though, like one of those whistles. Okay, smiling little Jack whistle. And we get our exclusive pet pouch. So this just expands your pet's inventory by like two rows. Okay, another Nyan Jack pet whistle. We have four boxes left. Let's open up the next one. Phoenix whistle. Okay, let's go for the next one. Christmas alpaca whistle. Oh, alpacas are good for getting that commerce mount, so maybe I'll sell that guy. And we get our free adoption medal. Okay, so we have two more boxes. Those are the same with you benefits. Okay, yeah, and it'll also list the rewards right here, too. So we'll leave that open. Lemongrass Flora Whistle. So this is for, like, a floral fairy pet? Okay, we have one left. Let's see what we get from this one. So far, we didn't. we haven't gotten any of the new pets so far. Okay, and another Christmas alpaca whistle. So we didn't get any of the new pets. But we do get the winter premier pet selection box. So this will let us... That'll let us pick any of the four new pets from the event. Okay, so let's see how this box works. Okay, so here are the four new pets. And you can only pick one of them. So I kind of want the Dazzling Cat one more than the Blazing one, and I don't really have any interest in the whales, so I'll be taking that one. Okay, so let's summon it, and we get a cutscene. Okay, so now we can pick a combat talent for it to get like two times bonus XP. You know, we'll pick magic skills. Because magic skills are sometimes a pain in the butt to like level up. Okay, so here's the uh, pet. And here's what happens if you like mount it. I kind of want them to release, like, a giant cat that you can actually, like, ride around. I mean, this isn't really... This isn't really a mount, not really. And what kind of summon time does he have? Let's take a look at that, too. So it looks like it... I think we've had it summoned about three minutes, so it looks like it can be summoned for about two hours, 120 minutes. Looks like it's about... The right summon time for this pet, but you can of course extend that by uh, bin sinking it. Oh, and we also have our Nyan gem boxes, so let's use those. And it looks like we got a topaz, two topaz, and a spinal from those. And then the book, which we can just toss. So this is its inventory, and we can expand the inventory in the summon time by fin syncing it later. So overall, what do I think of this pet gotcha? I think the rates were not too like we didn't have we didn't have very much luck. But I do like this. I have to admit I like this right here. I like that we got the uh, option to pick one of the new pets that came out and had a 100% guarantee to get it. That's good. I want to see this in like future pet pet boxes. This was a really good idea and I think this was the part of it that convinced me to like play this gotcha at all. So I would like to see that in like future uh, pet box releases.